the track club's really pushing getting vaccinated. And okay. like, uh, so one thing they're doing is not last year they mailed out the race like numbers that you wear. Yeah. You know, so the, last year they mailed out the race card. The race card. <laughs> <laughs> I think that is what it's called a card. <laughs> so they mailed that out last year. Um, and they're not mailing it out this year. And their reason is because of COVID. So they don't want they so mail? They don't want to mail it out. So instead, you have to come get your race number in person. It's because of COVID. They want <laughs> yes. people gathering. Yep. And uh, if you're not vaccinated, if you're vaccinated, you don't have to wear a mask when you enter. If you're not, then you do have to wear a mask. And you also have to get screened to make sure you don't have COVID by a dog. By a dog? Wait, what? The dog's going to sniff out to see if you have COVID. Okay. <laughs> so you got to go there and like, get some dog to fucking sniff, like, <laughs> some goddamn German shepherd to go and just, like, sniff you and see if you got COVID. Like, it's fucking weird as shit. Yeah. And that's like, that's wrong. Also, like, um, just so, even showing up at the track club, like, people are like, Asking people to get vaccinated and shit like that and telling them, like, not to have their mask on. These are all, like, volunteers Mm -hmm. that are saying this to people that are paying members of this, like, organization. And so all these random people are now being given this authority. It's like, well, at least I'm in the right, you know. I'm Mm -hmm. the one who believes in vaccination and masks. So I'm the one that's allowed to have the authority over people that don't. we got to make sure these little retarded babies (laughs) (laughs) can fucking do this shit. It's like retarded babies. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, I think it, I think a lot of it's about um, power. Yeah, it is, but it's so weird too that they want to also make sure to pass out the power to all those other people. It's like, ah, oh, you're just passing power out to a bunch of people, and even okay, if you're on the right side, maybe you're not a maniac. But how many people have the potential to be maniacs that are going to use this power yeah. to be maniacs? <laughs> you know, maniac. <laughs> I'm just thinking that too. Um. Yeah, uh, do you think that it being a dog is uh, let me in? Do you all mind addressing the conflict with the Dewey Decimal System? The conflict with the Dewey Decimal System, <laughs> yeah. dude. That sounds. I heard something about that. Oh, really? Is it a thing? No, I think it's a joke. Oh, somebody. It's a joke I heard recently on stage. I think. Oh, like somebody says that. Yeah, it might and have been him. A, it's a uh, yes, yeah, Team Prochaska. Yes, yeah. um, old guest. Not Thomas. Shout out to somebody who is not Thomas. So do you think getting snipped by a dog is like more degrading or something? Because it's like I just I just think it's completely ridiculously unnecessary. And it's like what if well, what if you're allergic to dogs? What if you're scared of dogs? What any number of things? What if you just don't want to get fucking snipped? I think a lot by of people somebody's goddamn guard dog. Who are a lot, I think the there's probably a lot of crossover between people who don't want to get vaccinated and are afraid of dogs. <laughs> What do you think that crossover is? I just people, just cool people that are <laughs> afraid of dogs and don't want to be vaccinated. Maybe. And, you know, but man, don't uh, look like us. <laughs> but, oh, ivermectin is also a good alternative to vaccination as well. It's one of those things that's weird that they're not trying, that they keep trying to pretend like it's the not vaccination a good treatment. Is not, it's not even a vaccine from what I understand, right? Isn't it just kind of the same thing? Like it just kind of makes it where if you get sick, you're... Um, not as sick. Uh, well, That's what I heard. do that too, though. Like, oh. you can still get the flu if you get the flu vaccine. Oh, but. but I thought the flu was like antibodies. And like well, this one is like, the. It, I guess it doesn't matter. Well, there are, the Johnson & Johnson is more like traditional vaccines. Oh, okay. So the traditional vaccines have like, there's like the dead virus inside of it. Yeah. But the new virus that they, or vaccine they created for this is an mRNA vaccine. And so it, um, I don't know exactly how it operates but it it basically creates the spike protein within you Mm -hmm. so that it can respond uh to covid in a different way when it shows up it's weird this is the weirdest thing about the whole vaccine thing to me it's weird that we're being asked not to question things oh yeah if you question anything about this then you're in the wrong you don't need questions you just need to do it just do it just do it you know yeah no matter what it is it's fucking weird and but it's also like it's one of those things that and bottom line no matter what your health is like your fucking job that's Mm -hmm. you that's what you do nobody else needs to walk up to you and tell you how you're going to be healthy or not i see the uh, i see the 
devil advocate on that though that they're saying well it's more public you're gonna spread disease we all need to if everybody doesn't do this then it's gonna uh you know there's gonna be like a herd problem and you're gonna get you're gonna make everybody else sick and, well i mean yeah you can say sure, which is the whole thing can, from the start you can say that but at the same time you still as an individual need to go talk to your doctor and find out if you can even get it your doctor might be like oh no it's gonna be bad for you because you've got yeah. these conditions you know yeah. like you may not be able to get it because you may fucking kill yourself getting the vaccine yeah that's true and they're like giving them out at arby's and shit you know yeah it's ridiculous they're giving them out at, uh, at my job they're uh, yeah. like, you can go get them if you want them, and it's like you can get dipping dots. Fucking ridiculous. And you can get a, get the get oh, the vaccine. I, I don't know if they're giving out to customers. They're giving out to employees. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get yeah. dipping dots if you're an employee. Oh uh, yeah, you could. You could. But <laughs> I've had just make it sure. Right. No, I don't think customers can get it. Um, I don't know. It just seems, it seems ridiculous and way beyond like a point that's reasonable. The numbers are just dropping. There's, I mean, sure. Indians I've heard of this. Fucked. Like, uh, I've heard this several times from the Doomer type people. They're like, uh, you, you know, now that people are not getting vaccinated, we'll never reach herd immunity because you didn't do it fast enough. Well, man, that's actually what Brett Weinstein was saying about ivermectin. It was like, if we don't act fast enough, I mean, if we were to act faster and we were to mm -hmm. get this stuff out and we were to get it to people that have COVID, yeah. you know, then we could help solve this COVID thing. It's like, we do have a chance of eliminating this disease if we use ivermectin whenever mm -hmm. it pops up and stop it in conjunction with the vaccines. Okay. So it's like, why not do both? Like, yeah. and there's like, there's doctors that won't use it on their patients whenever there's just time and time again, it's been proven to be effective in, um, De like uh, lowering the effects of COVID. Hmm. And they said, you know, it's harder to do if they get later on in, you know, yeah. if you've had COVID for a while. But I think it's crazy that the, the the vaccine came out supposedly in record time. Nobody expected it to be out this early. Yeah. Yet we're just like people were just a little slow about getting vaccinated. So like now the, the, everything worked out so perfectly where it was just – it came out just in time for everybody to just get real quick and then it'd be not a problem anymore. Oh, oh yeah. 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 Seems kind of, I follow it's these just bullshit. It's just <laughs> things people are say. And like, where's the evidence? Where which, prove it to me? Like, why you gotta, why? Yeah. Like you're saying, you're not allowed to ask questions. questions. Like why, what, why what are you some kind of you? fucking anti-vaxxer? I almost feel like the whole anti-vaxxer thing. I'm not like, this is like conspiratorial.